Salut dragi prieteni, astăzi voi realiza episodul numărul 2 din seria Gothic. Am ajuns la tabăra veche. Acum vom fi abordați de un galen. Unde crezi că te duci? În tabără. You ain't come to make trouble, have you? No. Spunem că Diego trebuie să mă întâlnesc cu Diego. Diego says I'm to meet him in the camp. Okay, in you go then. Și astfel am ajuns la tabăra veche, da? Gildurile din tabăra veche sunt următoare, da? La început sunt minerii. Aceștia își duc traiul luminând cristale. Pentru o anumită cantitate de cristale, el primește toate cele necesare. Majoritatea minerilor plătesc tribut gărzilor pentru protecție. Ei reprezintă majoritatea coloniei și cea mai mică treaptă a acestea. Un miner se poate alătura oricărei tabere. Aceștia lucrează în mina veche. La început, jucătorul este miner, după care urmează shadow, adică umbrele, devii umbră după ce treci câteva teste. Umbrele sunt oamenii noi care încă nu au dovedit că sunt destul de buni pentru a deveni gărți. Majoritatea lucrează pentru gărți ca spion sau jefuiesc alți oameni fără a fi prinși. Acesta este motivul pentru care am primit această denumire. Majoritatea umbrelor se luptă cu săbii ușoare și arcuri. Ei primesc la început o, o costumație care îi reprezintă, dar își pot cumpăra o armură care îi protejează mai bine. Bun, v-am spus două gilduri din tabra veche, acum mai să și uh, jucăm puțin, da? Ce ne-a spus Diego? Să mergem la Toru să vorbim cu el. You don't look as though you'd just let anyone get into the castle. Only Gomez's men are allowed in the castle. If I gave you a certain amount of ore, would you let me in the castle? For a certain amount. How much? Well, it'd have to take a while to count the ore. Long enough to make sure me and my boys are busy counting while you slip by. Good, good. So tell me, how much? One thousand nuggets should be enough. De la începutul jocului, nu avem de unde să-i dăm. Deci în această cetate vom găsi magicienii și știm de la început că trebuie să dăm o scrisoare marului magician de foc. Bun, nu avem o mie de bucăți. Hai să spunem că avem o scrisoare pentru magul șef. Trebuie să ajungem în castle. Am o lettere aici pentru High Fire Mage. And you expect me to let you stroll inside the castle to hand it over and collect your reward? Yeah. Okay. Show me the letter. I'm not letting you handle it. Forget it. Okay. I've forgotten. Bun. Deci nici așa nu putem asta. Și pentru a intra în această cetate ce trebuie să lucrez pentru Gomez să fac ceva ca să am de acceptul să intru acolo. I want to work for Gomez. Oh yeah. And what makes you think Gomez will be interested in having you work for him? Diego says you decide who Gomez is interested in. Ah, if Diego thinks you're okay, why doesn't he take care of you? Look, let me explain. Diego's gonna test you. If he thinks you're good enough, I'll let you into the castle to see Gomez. Whatever happens after that is up to you, okay? I'll talk to Diego. Bun, hai să cerem și de la el o sarcină. O Why don't you give me the test? It ain't that easy, kid. Any newcomer who wants to get anywhere needs a patron. That patron has to be one of Gomez's people. He'll test you. And if you fail, you're his responsibility. That's the law around here. There must be something you want done. No. The things we guards deal with are a bit above you, kid. You just stick to the task your patron sets for you. I'm quite capable of doing anything you tell me to. Oh, so you're intent on failing, eh? There is one thing that only someone who's not with Gomez can see to. But I'm warning you, you blow this and you'll be in mighty big trouble. I'm ready for your task. What I'm about to tell you is between you and me, and nobody else must ever hear about it. Understood? Sure. We have a problem with a guy from the new camp. His name's Mordrag. He's been stealing from the ore barons. 
Of course, that applies to a lot of the rogues in the new camp. But this guy has the nerve to come to our camp and sell our stolen goods to our boys. He's gone too far. But he knows I can't do anything about it. Because he's under the protection of the mages. Sounds to me like the mages are your problem. Yeah, but they're a problem that's hard to solve. A few years back, one of the shadows tried to stab the high magician of the Circle of Fire while he was sleeping. They found him later in the Outer Ring. In fact, he was scattered all over the Outer Ring. Why did the mages protect that Mordrag? Because they use him as a gopher. Our local mages are in contact with the mages over in the new camp. They often send gophers back and forth. They're likely to become very unpleasant if I throw one of their gophers out of the camp or have him killed. What about me? What do you think the mages will do to me? You're new here. You'll be okay. But I'm responsible for what my boys do. That's why it's vital that you keep your mouth shut. Where can I find Mordred? You'll find him at the south gate on the other side of the castle, just beyond the entrance. The bastard wouldn't dare come any further into the camp. Do you want me to kill the guy? I want you to make sure I never see his face around here again. I don't care how you do it. I'll take care of it. Bun, am luat și misiunea, da? Nu uitați, misiunea lui Torus, da? Dacă dăm pe ea, ne spune cam ceea ce ne-a spus Torus, da? O să vă explic care e treaba cu misiunea, când o vom face. Bun, mergem la Diego, vorbim cu Diego acum. Mai aflăm informații. It's the biggest and most powerful of the three camps. Gomez and his guys control the camp, and thereby the whole ore trade. Once a month, the king sends us everything we need. We've got the old guy in our grip, you understand? He sends us wine, bread, meat, weapons, everything. You can also get some of it. All you have to do is join Gomez's people. I've talked to Thoris. And what did he say? He says that I can join the old camp if you think that I'm good enough. Uh -huh. Looks like I have myself a new job. Do we start right now? First, there are a few things you should know. What about the two other camps? The two other camps split up to pursue their crazy escape plans. There's the new camp in the west of the colony, where the mages think they can just detonate the barrier as soon as they've scraped enough ore together. And then there's the sect loonies in the east. Their camp is in the middle of the swamp, and they're praying to their idol to set them free. He hasn't responded so far. If I were you, I wouldn't waste my time on those madcaps. Tell me more about the barrier. There isn't much to tell. It's impenetrable. Mm -hmm. What happens if I just walk out of here? The last one who tried that reached the other side a dead man. This damn barrier lets you in, but you'll never get out of here. If there's a way out, I'll find it. You're already in a rush to get out of here? But you've only just arrived. What do I have to know to be accepted in the old camp? If you want to join the camp, you'll have to earn some brownie points. There are a few influential people in the outer ring. Most of them are shadows. If you manage to impress them, it'll earn you a few brownie points. Then you'll have to stand the test of faith. Mm -hmm. Besides, there are a lot of skills every new arrival has to learn. The more you learn, the more valuable you'll be for us. Where do I find the important people? Well, you're looking at one of them. Then there's Thoris. You already know him. As for the others, you'll have to find that out by yourself. If you don't manage to do that, you don't belong here anyway. Just go through the outer ring and talk to people. Then you'll find out who's important. Who can teach me? 
Start with fingers. He's the most skillful among us. If you keep your eyes peeled, you'll find other people who can teach you. Where can I find fingers? His hut's kind of hidden. It's next to the castle wall. Just start out here and go towards the arena. When you're at the castle gate, go down to the left and you'll be heading for the arena. Bun, hai să mai luăm o misiune și de la Diego, te sucuraj. What's the test of faith? You have to go to the old mine. There you'll meet a guy called Ian. He'll give you a list. This list is important. It contains all the items the guys in the mine need from us. They'll get the stuff with the next convoy. No problem. Yes, there is a problem. The new camp must not get that list. Like I said, the list is important. If you do it right, you'll get much further. If the list is so important, why should Ian give it to me? Because you're going to tell him Diego sent you. I'll tell him. Where can I find the old mine? Go to Graham. He's a cartographer. Tell him that I sent you and that you need a map. It'll show you the way to the mine. He lives to the left of the north gate. Can you teach me something? Yes, I can teach you to improve your dexterity or your strength. Diego, mă învăț să dexteritate și forță, da? Am înțeles. Come back soon. There are many things you need to learn. De vorbi cu el. Cam atât. Bun. Take care. Intrăm acum în coliba lui Diego, da? Găsim aici o placă, un pahar, da? Aici găsim un cufăr, deoarece suntem la început, nu prea avem bani și asta și furăm puțin. Dreapta, stânga, stânga, dreapta, dreapta, dreapta. Bun. Cărniță, cristale, ce mai e? Brânză, apă, Două chei. Cheile, cu cheile acelea, să deschid cuferele. Hai să vedem și câte e uh, ceasul, 16 și 18 minute. Bun. Am luat două misiuni, da? Testul credinței de la uh, Diego și misiunea lui Torus. Uh, acum, hai să cunoaștem puțin oamenii din uh, tabăra vechi. Vorbim cu Grim. I am new here. Just arrived, have you? I'm Grim. I haven't been here for long either. I was thrown in with the load before you. What's life like here? Easy going. As long as you pay your share of protection money to the guards. What do I have to do if I want to get admitted to this camp? Well, first of all, you have to become a shadow. Therefore, you have to find somebody who supports you Somebody who explains everything to you and takes responsibility for you. If I was you, I'd try to keep close to Diego. I did it like that. He's quite all right. He'll make you take the test of faith. That's different from everybody. Then there'll be some other smaller tasks from other shadows. If you manage them, you'll be with us. Hang on. And how far have you got with your tests? I've already talked to Dexter and Sly and Fingers. They are some of the most influential shadows here in the camp. Did you Dexter, Sly, Fingers? What was your test of faith? I can't tell you, man. You have to be silent about things like that here. There must be something about that story. Well, now I've got the information from Grim. Let's go more forward. Da, o să vorbim cu bloduin ăsta, o să ne ceară taxa de protecție. Hey, yo! Are you talking to me? Hey, I'm warning you, people like you can get into trouble awfully quick round here. And most of the guys they chuck in here are bastards. They think they can do what they like to you, but we won't allow that. Gomez wants some peace in the camp, and we guards make sure he gets it. But it's a job that doesn't come cheap. That's why I'm asking you for some ore. Look on it as a kind of token of friendship. You help us, and we'll help you. If you get in trouble, we'll be there for you. 
Is that a threat? On the contrary, it's an offer of friendship. Da, o să-i dau niște cristale. Dacă nu-i dau cristale, How much ore acesta were you thinking of? o să-l trimeată pe Grimm, o să ne atragă într-o cursă și ne, vor, ne va bate, da? Here's your ore. I can always use a friend or two. You seem to be a clever lad. From now on, we'll be watching out for you. But that doesn't mean to say you can do what you like around here, okay? See ya. Don't you worry about anything here in the camp. We'll be looking out for you. Bun. Mergem mai departe, da? Uh, hai să vorbim cu Baltaran asta, să vedem ce e cu el. Îmi place să fumezi. Da. I'm new here. Who are you? I am Bal Taran of the Brotherhood of the Sleeper. What is the Brotherhood of the Sleeper? We're a community of believers in a new faith. Our camp is situated in the east, in the swamp. I've come to preach the words of the Sleeper to strangers like you. Who is the Sleeper? The Sleeper is our Redeemer. He disclosed himself five years ago through Iberian, our master. Since then, we have renounced the three gods, and you should do so as well. The gods just stood by and watched while we were exiled to this prison. But the sleeper will lead us to freedom. How do I get to the Brotherhood's camp? I'm busy, but Bal Parvez should be somewhere in this camp as well. He's near the marketplace, on the other side of the castle. I believe he's even got his own hut there. Tell me about the sleeper's teachings. The sleeper is a powerful being, maybe even more powerful than Inos, the god of light. He is with us in spirit, but his power is still limited. He has been sleeping for a thousand years, but now the moment of his awakening is near. He has chosen us to be witnesses to his awakening and to spread his word. So listen, all those who join the sleeper will have immortal souls, but those who are against him will be punished. But the sleeper is compassionate and sends proof of his might to all who doubt him. Some people never learn. How does your God prove his might? He speaks to us through visions. Whoever hears his voice no longer doubts his might. If you take the weed which grows in the swamp, you will be close to the sleeper and able to hear him. Some people even see images. I see. What will the way to freedom look like? We are preparing a great invocation of the sleeper, in which all novices create the contact together. In this invocation, the sleeper will reveal the path to freedom. Hang on, not go rushing into anything. I need to get into the castle. Can you help me? I fear I cannot, brother. The only ones among us who may enter the castle are those who supply the weed to Gomez. We gather swamp weed and sell part of it to the old camp in exchange for goods from the outside world. If you were one of the couriers working for Kor Kalom, you could get into the castle. But for that, you would need to be one of us. What do you want to do in the castle anyway? I want to meet somebody there. And why don't you just wait until he comes out? He's one of the magicians. Oh, well, they never leave the castle. You really will have to get in. What do you want from them anyway? Magic runes or potions? Correct. That's right. 
I knew it. What else would a guy like you want with the mages? I can give you some good advice. Forget the mages. They take far too much ore for their stuff. Magic runes and potions are much cheaper in our camp. Bun. Am aflat informații și de la Bal Parvez ăsta. Hai să mergem la Graham, care ne-a spus că e cartograf, Diego ne-a spus treaba asta. Vorbim cu el. Hi, I'm new here. I'm Graham. I draw maps. I haven't seen you here before. What do you want? Diego sent me. He asked you to give me a map with a route to the old mine. No problem. For you, only 20 ore. Hold on, oh, Diego said you should part. give me the map, not that you should sell it to me. But I'm not interested. Have you any idea how difficult it is to make a map like this? 20 is my special price for friends of Diego. Usually I take 50. Give me the map or I'll take it. Hey, be cool, man. I don't want trouble. Here, take the map and leave me alone. Bun. Hai să vedem și harta. Da? Documente. Asta e harta. Bun. Unde X-ul cu portocaliu e din a veche. Bun, am văzut. Hai să mai obținem informația. Da? Am obținut pe aici, pe sus. Hai să mergem și la... Bravo. Să vorbim și cu el. How are you doing? Well, since I stopped working in the mine, I can't really complain. And where do you get your ore from? I help people who have problems. If you get into trouble with influential people here, I can help you sort the thing out. Well, there was a time when things were If I was in trouble, you could help me? How? Well, let's assume you're in trouble with Thoris. You better never get into trouble with him, but then, well, you never know. Thoris can be quite stubborn. When he's pissed off with you once, he'll never talk to you again. And that's a bad thing. As a greenhorn, you depend on him. So you come to see me. I know a lot of people here Thoris listens to. They put in a good word for you, and Thoris is your friend again. Of course, the boys want to see some ore for these kind of favors. Your ore. And I take care that your ore gets to the right people. Could you tell me which of the shadows belongs to the influential people here? You want to impress the right people, do you? Diego has the most power of all the shadows. He trusts Fingers, Whistler, and Sly. Dexter and Fisk sell their stuff on the market square. They have many customers, even the guards. And that makes them rather influential. And then there's Scatty. He's in charge of the arena and determines who fights and all that. Many people here owe him ore. He's important as well. Bun, am aflat care sunt oameni importanți. Aici avem o tigaie. Hai să prăjim puțină carne. Da? Carnea de la moleraz, de la scevăge. Da? Și așa se roasă, da? Se ține tasta cât râlă apăsată și după care săgeată sus. Bun. Am vorbit cu oamenii ăștia după aici. Hai să mergem mai departe. Facem un tur al taberei pentru a afla cât mai multe informații. Asta e miner. Deocamdată nu vorbim cu personajul ăsta, deoarece acesta ne va da o misiune, da? Îl evităm. Povărăm pe jos pe aici. Dacă mergem pe sus plus, vom da de Derek. Aici la fel este o Whistler care ne va da și el o misiune. Deci eu vreau să vă prezint acum numai persoanele care de unde pot procura informații. Aici. Hey man. Nu, deocamdată nu nu vreau să vorbesc cu asta, deci 
gardă, da? Aici ar găsim și pop bal parvez, care ne va duce în tabăra nouă. Vă spuneam că sus acolo, da? E un personaj care... Uh, o să-mi dea bătaie acum la început. Aici, uitați, mor drag. Personajul despre care ne-a vorbit uh, Torus. Și cu acel uh, personaj vom avea de făcut o misiune. Hai să urcăm pe scară. Da. Și mergem în stânga. Deci în acest episod mi-a propus să, să vorbim numai cu oamenii care îmi dau informații. Aici, la ferărie, hai să vorbim și cu Cuno Ferraru. It looks as if you knew what you were doing. Nobody ain't complained yet. But that would be a bad idea anyway. Every idiot here needs a sword, and that is what they get from me. How long does it take you to make one blade? That depends. I'm as fast as a hurricane with simple swords. Of course, only on condition that the price motivates me. A freak like Whistler usually has to wait longer for his toy than other people. Why? Doesn't he pay enough? No, on the contrary. He gave me 150 ore for his last sword. The guy is into ornaments and girly stuff like that, and of course that's not cheap. Hey, you ain't curious at all, are you, pal? Oh, I'm afraid that if I want to make money, I have to learn from the Huno. Acesta vă va învăța să faceți săvi. Aici um, trebuia să fiu un personaj, dar văd că s-a făcut s-a întunecat. Și trebuia să fiu un personaj care ne va da uh, o cabană. Unde vom putea nopta. Da, cred că aici este, dacă nu mă înșel. Hai să dormim puțin, da? Gai, ăsta, cred că, da, cu ăsta trebuie vorbit. Salut! Hello! Hmm, I haven't seen you. Just recently arrived. Have you already decided which No, what do you think? Well, it depends. Each camp has its advantages. Until you've made your decision, you can stay here. A hut just became available. <laughs> what are the advantages of... If you pay protection money to the guards, you can have a laid-back life here. They always interfere if one of the paying... Besides, you can only get the goods from the outside world cheap here. These things are unaffordable in the... And what if two people fight each other who both pay protection money? Then the guards just watch until one of them kills the other. Then they do him in. Hmm. What goods are considered precious here? Everything from the outside world. Bread, cheese and bacon and, above all, beer and wine. Not the cheap rice schnapps from the new camp, but really good stuff. You always get a good price for weapons, and armor is really expensive. The guards took the old armor off the prison guards after they killed them. You can always recognize them by their armor. They only sell it to other guards. You could never get a hold of one as an outsider. I think I've heard enough about the... I like it. Which of the huts can I... The hut over there with the little canopy is empty. Bun. Mai aflat informații. Asta este coliba mea de acum încolo, da? Mergem mai departe. Mai am cu câțiva oameni să vi prezint, după care voi încheia acest episod. Aici nu prea avem, da? Aici, în stânga, da? 
este Scati. Da, vorbim cu el. What's your job? I'm in charge of the arena. I organize the bets, hire new fighters, you know. I thought the old camp and the new camp didn't get on. So why do you let their people fight here? It's simple. There's fights here once a week, and the diggers always like to see one of the rogues from the new camp. If one of them fights, there's more bets. And that personally, I can't stand the swines from the new camp. But business. Da, bun. Antrenez luptător aici dacă vrea să mă antrenez. Da, o să venim mai târziu la el și o să vorbim cu el. Cam atâtea informații am, pute, am putut culege. Bun, acesta este episodul numărul 2. O să revin cu următorul episod.